I'm here at the Museum of Contemporary Canadian Art, and here's the invite, and here's the wall text. Invite, wall text. So Pulp Fiction. This has a bunch of artists in it, uh, and as you can see, it's a group of 14 artists from across the country to examine a phenomenon that emerged in the early 1990s, where many young artists began to form loose networks. So I'm thinking the Royal Art Lodge of Winnipeg, though I don't think they're actually specifically represented here. And my guest commentator for today is Maureen, who's playing the music. That's, that's very good. <laughs> These are dolls, and this is something I've seen a lot of. Well, I like uh, the dog doll because it looks like the dog from uh, that Daft Punk video. <laughs> really? I was thinking McGruff. Oh, okay. McGruff. Yeah, that too. But maybe, maybe not. I haven't seen Daft Punk, but my son has a Daft Punk t-shirt, ah. which is uh, very, very cool, apparently. Mm. I think there's like a Daft Punk collective that build robots or music and stuff. Oh, I, could be, I could be wrong. This is a very uh, ski chalet, James Bond kind of duo, what do you think? <laughs> I think so, yeah. I like the Canadian guy over here with the HBC coat. Yes, the, it uh, is, and this is the actually... The Hudson Bay colors. There's a painting show down the street with a bunch of nude models in cabins wearing Hudson's Bay colors nice. as well. I don't know, Hudson's Bay. Kind of got that Canadiana thing happening. Who was Mr. Hudson Bay, anyways? Mr. And Hudson? Mr. Hudson. <laughs> <laughs> and who was Mr. Hudson's wife? Mrs. Hudson. Mrs. Hudson. Okay. <laughs> I don't mean to hammer, hammer home the point here. These are very, very cool. And we shall move on.